ready or not. Here comes Mama. Look at her. Mm. But I ain't one to gossip, so if anyone asks you, you ain't heard it from me. Hello. <laughs> I don't know why I've been saying that, and every time that I say it, it makes me feel like weird. I don't know. It's weird. Anywho, um, on today's video, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different because I was eating and a package that I had been waiting on arrived and I had been waiting on it. And um, I was like, you know what? I need to go make a video right now. So I'm going to do mukbang and makeup. It just came to me. So I got, uh, there's a place out here in Podunkville. Man, I'm almost already done. Um, so it's, uh, 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 why am I not remembering? Meatloaf. I love meatloaf. I don't know why I love meatloaf so much, but I do. So it's meatloaf with the, uh, mashed potatoes and gravy. I don't really care too much for mashed potatoes and gravy. And I got, always get double green beans. Oh, I don't eat the bread, so we could toss that. Uh, double green beans right here. Always get the double green beans. Cause you know, a girl needs her veggies. Then for dessert, which I kind of probably am going to get into that first. I have, oh my God, if y'all don't know, it's making me salivate. If y'all don't know about Tres Leches Cake, y'all missing out. Tres Leches Cake is the bomb diggity dog. Oh my God, it's so good. So we're going to be eating that. And I just got this in. I haven't even opened it. So this is all like straight out the box, straight out the package. Everybody I had seen has been talking about this on social media. I haven't even looked into the company. I don't know who owns it, whose product this is or what, but I've just been seeing it everywhere. And it's called Hide, okay? While I got y'all here, why don't I do a little thumbnail? Hold on. Should I make it look like I'm upset? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe one of those will be good. Anywho, so I'm going to open it. You can see it still has the plastic on it. See that? I haven't even opened it. So I didn't know what my shade was. It's a really cool website. So you go on there and you tell them like the makeup that you're already using, the foundation or whatever. And I've always been on the lookout for a good concealer. I mean, I have tried so many concealers. I picked out just a handful of them just so that y'all could see that I ain't lying, okay? I've tried this Il Maquillage. I tried the Tarte, the tape shape, because everybody, and at first I really did think it was tape. I mean, shape tape or whatever you call it. Um, I've just tried so many. I've tried drugstore brands. I've tried, you know, uh, popular brands. I've tried, you know, just old school, what is this, Cover Girl. Because I was like, cover girl been around for so long. She should know what she's doing. And you know, I don't know if it's just me. And if I'm just really particular on my concealer coverage. But I got, look. Look at this. Can y'all see that? Look at this. Look at that. I've got spots. I've got circles. I've got things that need to be concealed. Okay. And so I was like, you know what? I saw a demo and this is what got me. I'm going to tell y'all right now. What got me is I saw a dude and he was covered in tattoos and he got some of this stuff, one application, put it on, started smearing it around and it looked like skin and it covered everything. So I was like, dang, sold. If that this makeup can cover his tattoos, then it can cover my dark under eye circles. So we're about to do this today. Let me take another little bite of my little meatloaf. One of my friends, oh my God, it was so funny. So she's a foreigner and I was talking about meatloaf cause I love meatloaf. I don't know why I love meatloaf so much, but she was a foreigner and she was like, pulled me aside one day, right? And she was like, when you say that you love meatloaf, like you are you are saying meat love and i was like yeah 
meatloaf. And she was so going, no, meat, loaf, like loaf, like I love you. And I was going, oh my God, not meat love, meat loaf, like a loaf of bread. <laughs> I just thought that was so funny. And she was like, oh, I thought every time you say meat loaf that you were saying meat loaf. And I was like, oh my God. So now every time I eat meat loaf, I think about that. It's so funny. So. The one that they told me was my tone because like I said on the website, you put in the foundations that you're currently using, the tones that are for you, and they match it up according to what they think it's supposed to be. So they recommended sand, but I always say better safe than sorry. So I got the shade below it and the shade above it just in case, okay? Anywho, this is the packaging. It feels very nice. like. Ooh la la. I like it. It's a matte. You see that? Hide. Hide the dark spots. Hide the shame. Oh, how do you open it? How the heck? Oh, it's a twist. So you twist. I thought you just pulled it. And it says underlining. Hide. Multi-use full coverage concealer. Let's see if it can see, conceal all the darkness from all the times that I didn't sleep properly, especially when I was young. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna put right here. Oh, that's a, a little dab will do you, look. That's kind of a lot. Okay. No. Oh. Wait, what? What? Can y'all see that? Look at the difference. I, I mean, what? Oh. What? All right, all right. I'm gonna, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Let's try a little warm beige. Let's do it on this side. I'm shook. Okay, let's see. One, two. I think I did four on the other one. Okay, this one I can already tell is way too orange. Way too orange. But it did cover it up. Look, but you can see, look, see? Way too orange. And see this one? I mean... I guess they were right. I guess that they were right because you know what? Honestly, this already does look like I don't even have nothing else on my face. Look, all I have is this. I don't have nothing. I mean, you can see a little bit of my mustache already. You know, you see my little dark spots right here. You can see all of this. I don't have no makeup on my face. I only put the concealer. And look at how it already, I mean, if I just wanted to, I could just dab a little bit of this under my eyes and then I could be ready and go out about my day. I'm gonna get a little booty wipe and I'm gonna wipe underneath my eyes and then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna put this one on. And if it does it again, I just may have found the, I mean, it. you know, I'm gonna be like, oh. The Mecca of concealers. Now we're going to try this one. Okay? And I'm going to try, because this one is a little bit lighter, so I'm going to do the light beige under this side, and then I'm going to do the one that they recommended again, but I'm going to do it under this side. So let's see what it does. Okay? Oh, and I got to tell y'all that um, <clears throat> this is just on a fresh face of skin. So imagine with primer, with moisturizer. I can't even imagine. So let's go ahead and try it, okay? And let's see if it wows me again. Let me put that sponge down and take a little bit of a bite of my Tres Leches cake. Mm. Mm. 
Why is that so good? Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm, they put a little bit of pineapple up in there. I ain't never had it before with some pineapples up in there. That is good. Mmm, mmm. Okay, one more bite, and then I'll blend this out. Mm. Mm. That is so good. I had to do my happy dance. Honestly, this is a little bit too light for my skin tone. Now, I know that I do that sometimes. So what I would probably do is I'd probably put this underneath and then I'd kind of blend my foundation up and make it look kind of, you know, a little bit more natural. But if I really want to go with a full natural on look, I'm going to stick with the, the one that they told me, which is sand. So I'm going to put that one under here, like I said. And I'm even going to put some on my sunspots and see what it does there. And this time, you see, there's a whole glop that comes out. You see that? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to kind of just rub off the excess. Less is more. And I'm going to try that approach do some on my on my little sunspots right here so I'm just gonna put one I'll just put one right there all right and guys if it covers my sunspots and the dark circles I'm in heaven oh my god here we go moment of truth okay that definitely looks like a good tone for me they did good on that I'll give them that I would definitely give them that. They did a really good job on matching just by my, what I told them that I already wear. That is amazing. On a website? And then I'm going to go ahead and. And this ain't even the foundation. This is just the concealer. I mean, dang, look at this. Look at that coverage. And I'm up close, so you can see everything. I mean, thank God I shaved my mustache, or you could see that too. But look, I didn't blend really good right there, but look at that coverage. Ooh, do I got a pimple? I got a boogie too. Okay, so do you see that? You see that? I mean... I'm impressed. That is pretty good. I am just as impressed with this hide concealer as I am with this cake. And coming from me, that says a lot. So. Ooh. I dripped a little bit on my table. Uh, like uh, They say it's powerful. Hide anything in seconds. Our concealer full coverage and foundation, medium to full coverage, are custom formulated for optimal coverage that lasts. And let me just say, this is not sponsored. I just wanted to try this out. I just got to say that. I don't know. I see everybody else saying it, so I figure I got to say it too. Okay, lightweight. And it is lightweight. It really, really is lightweight. Like, it doesn't feel like I have like a gloopity glob of stuff under my face. You know what I mean? Which most stuff I do, but this one I don't. I really, really don't. Um, concealing creams cover anything without the cakey baggage in weight. See, uh, long lasting. Oh, sorry. I had an itch. Long lasting, breathable and hydrating. <gasps> oh, wh while it's on it, I also get my eyes hydrated. See, now that's what's up. I like that. Um, our concealing creams are formulated to resist sweat. Humidity. I live in Texas and I'm a sweaty beast. So this is already amazing to hear. Work extremely well with your skin and last all day long. Well, hot diggity dog. I think I'm I'm done. I think I'm done. Oh my god, I think I I need to try the foundation. So this is the foundation. It's in a white uh package. 
I think that that's all the products that they have for now. So they got the concealer, the foundation, and then they got a little premium little makeup sponge. Uh, okay, now I know what my next foundation is going to be because, I mean, look, the, the proof is in the pudding. And that pudding looks pretty good. I'm just saying. And speaking of pudding, I'm going to take one last bite. Did I say that my last bite was my last bite? If I did, I lied. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. Those little chunks of pineapple in here just do the deed. Mmm. Mmm, Okay, so this is the one. I mean, website was right about my color. It is full coverage. It is lightweight. It is everything. Now, to see if it is waterproof and all of that. I'm going to try this on these little dark spots. I got these two little dark things right here from where my beard used to be. And, uh. I'm going to try and cover those. Let's see. See my little goatee area right there? And, and and there's also a mole. Let's see if it covers that up. I mean, I like my mole, so I wouldn't want to cover it up. But I'm just saying it's right where my, my little shadow is. And I'm going to do it up close so y'all could see. Oh, my God. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see? Sorry if you can hear my, my mouth. I mean, I'm just going to blend that in on the, in the middle. And look at how well it covered my mole. I mean, you could kind of see it, but look. This is some good stuff, okay? Let me know down below if you have tried this. Let me know if you're going to try it. And um, let me know what you think. And uh, y'all can go ahead. You know what to do. Do y'all's thing. Like the video. All that. Everything that everybody always says to do. You know what to do. If you've been on here enough. And uh, while y'all leave, I'm just going to go ahead and finish eating my Tres Leches cake. Because. So. You can go ahead and see yourself out. Have a good day. And thanks for stopping by. Mm. Mm. I bit a nut wrong and it hurt my tooth. Mm. They forgot the shell. Dang it. Mm -hmm. I probably just gained five pounds off of that. For all you real ones that stayed, stayed here, just to watch me finish my cake, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate you. You are extra special to me because you watched my whole video. Now, thank you again, and I will see you next time.